Hello, it's a real pleasure to be with you from West London, from Stamford Bridge. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It is Chelsea taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, they don't come much bigger than this, do they? This will be a top quality game between two of the best sides in Europe. Let's hope it lives up to its billing. Edouard Mendy starts in goal and Goro Conte starts alongside Kai Havertz in central midfield and they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage Side. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Fernand Mendy starts with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And operating through the middle in attack today, Karim Benzema. And underway now in this Champions League semi final first leg. Federico Valverde so plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here but quick thinking defensively and it will be goalkeeper's ball Mikhail Nkunku the supporters want to see him have a go no problems grabbing hold of that one Kai Havertz. Superb block. And Kunku. Tremendous reflexes. Thibaut Courtois. He's driven in the corner. Well, he failed to get it away properly. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Eder Militao. Benzema. And now passing it through. Wonderful chance. And pushed away to safety. Well, the keeper deserves a lot of credit. That was a fine save, wasn't now, it? Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. And a goal! The opener in the semi-final. First goal of the contest. Out from the back. It's on the wrong side of the plane. He's trying to pass it to. It's intercepted. And it's a good finish. Yes, of course it is. But it's not good defending all round. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Determined defending. Vinicius Junior. Oh, good looking run. And not cleared away properly. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Free kick to Chelsea. And he read it superbly. Oh, 
Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Kamavinga. Beautifully weighted ball. Oh, but cutting it out in the nick of time. Nkunku. Karim Benzema. Real chance. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. They favoured a short one here. And a useful cross. But he dealt with that ball played in rather well. And Kunku. He's in behind. Well, it's gone in. A goal for Chelsea, who now are level. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and when he gets onto it, he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance, and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Valverde Real might threaten on the flank counter-attacking very much an option can they keep it going now delivering that deep cross not quite the clearance they were hoping for Conte Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. And decent acreage for Real Madrid to run into. The delivery towards the back post. Oh, that is a superb save. And he's fired over the corner. And the degree of difficulty wasn't all that high in terms of the save. Vinicius Jr. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal. Because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half, but he... Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. And Kunku, it's a perfect challenge. Bellingham and attempting the through ball excellent save from Thibaut Courtois and he takes it away well let's see what they have in store for them on the break well not to be in terms of the counter attack Nkunku. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And teammates around him. It's got to be! the post and back in play well threat averted well they won't come much closer than that it's a matter of inches from being a really good goal Benzema is with Vinicius Junior and the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack they need to get bodies back oh what an opportunity 
Oh, he saved it! Well, excellent from the keeper. That's a really top-class save. Well, he's had his name taken by the referee. Well, he knew he was going to get booked. It's a poor tackle, really. Substitution for Real Madrid. It's blocked. Benzema. Determined defending. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Into the final 20 minutes. Mount. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, here it is again. And it's all about the pace and transition. They're so quick to get out from the back. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Jude Bellingham. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Strong but fair tackle. Rodrigo. Might be a chance here. Still alive. Danger averted for now. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Takes aim. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. As so they look for an equaliser. And short it is. Now, will the cross work out for them? Attending to his defensive chores. Real Madrid on their side. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Now sending it in. Not really the ideal clearance. Benzema. A fine block. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Firing it in. And the keeper did more than enough. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent the last chance to grab an equaliser. Well, thumped clear. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. So, two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. The final whistle, and it's job done for Chelsea. They hold the advantage going into the return leg. Well, they'll be pleased with that victory, but it's a slender lead they're taking into the second leg. And I think they'll be confident, but it's going to be tight, that's for sure. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today. 